Hi, I'm Jamie. I'm going to show you how to use the new auto rig feature in Papa 2D version 3. So, to start off with, just drag your character in. Um, it could be made in parts or just a single character like this. Um, so, what we're going to do is we're going to just select it and click Make Guides. And you see, it adds these little guides, and you just move them into place like this um, into where the bones need to be. So, this is where the arm needs to be. And it's really quick. You can just just put them into the position. That's for the heads. This is for the kind of upper body and the upper spine. Uh, this is for the elbow and the wrist, and that's the uh, hip. And these are the where the thighs go. These are for the knee joints. And uh, these are for the ankles. Probably put them over there rather than where the drawing is. Okay, and then just click auto rig. And um, say so yes, you want to overwrite it. Just but in this case, just because uh, we, we created it before. And you see, and it creates a rig already. And you can sort of move them around. It's got like IK, um, got like you know, legs and stuff. And you'll see actually, it already comes with animations. So you can like, um, if we just turn off the controls, you can see it. Um, you've got a walk cycle, and you've got an idle. I've also kind of given you just a very simple animation um, controller script. If you turn it on, you can play it and he walks around with left and right and he has a little idle as he always stays okay so um, you can also get some more animations um, by clicking this button and you'll be able to uh, download more animations this here is the um, platformer character pack that you can get um, it comes with this character and he's uh, he's got quite a few different animations you can see like so you can like walk he's got the hold down control and he runs uh, he jumps um, he's got like a jump and spin, he's got crawl, he can, he can climb and uh, yeah if you leave him he'll he'll do some weights but tapping, yeah, there we go, he's scratching himself and then he's got another one which is, yeah there we go, he gets into his weight say that you were, um, you know, you rigged up a much smaller guy it's like, for example this guy yeah, let's just uh, zoom in on him wow. uh, I mean, it, all the same animations will work, so whatever your character is will will work. And, you know, so pretty much um, comply to any kind of biped character, really. Uh, I'm going to give you one more example. This is uh, using the Puppet Man um, setup. Uh, I've actually just flipped it so that he'll always be looking to the right. That's how, what um, is needed for auto rig, is that he's like three quarters looking to the right. So we can use. Um, all these parts all kind of separated out. You can see this that this this leg is um, it's one part. This is thing. So it will kind of work out whether or not it needs to sort of skin the uh, body part or um, it needs to um, parent it to the bone. So let's just select them all and click Make Guides, and then just place like the other side. Just place it into the correct position. See this character's got a. Uh, weird kind of bend the back but it'll kind of work okay I mean it's um, as long as it's generally in this kind of um, angle facing that direction it should work nicely the knees will always bend this way yeah and then just click auto rig now this time it'll take a little bit longer because each uh, part, that the separate part, needs to be skinned. Um, if you notice, the skinning takes a little bit longer now because it's actually doing um, a clever heat map um, skinning. So it'll, um, so even if like, um, for example, if you had two legs next to each other, it won't sort of skin that uh, that part to the other leg. So it's going for each piece. And there, it's rigged. Let's just see how they're looking. Yeah, it's okay. So there you have it. Um, that's auto rig for Proper 2D. Uh, let me know if you uh, want to know any more things. Um, just contact me on puppet2d at gmail.com. Bye.